During such an uncertain year, one thing we've all been able to depend on to get all the things we need and feel safe while doing it is Kroger. And joining me today is Ann Reed with Kroger. Thank you so much for talking with me today. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Now, for Kroger, protecting customers and associates is of the utmost importance. And that, of course, means cleanliness. How does Kroger make sure everyone is as safe as possible? Yeah, absolutely. Cleanliness has been a big part of our year, and it's hard to believe 2020 is almost over. But, you know, we're very focused on uh, cleaning and sanitizing carts. Um, there are wipes at all of the entryways, um, and there's also paper towels and spray for folks that want to be extra clean. We also have sanitizer at all of our um, spots throughout the store. So like in the deli bakery, meat department, all of, uh, you know, Starbucks, floral shops. And then we also have sanitizer at the end of each of our check stands. And then we ask that our associates also have uh, sanitizer handy, as well as our pickup associates on their uh, trolleys when they're getting uh, customers orders. That is fantastic. And of course, in addition to cleanliness, how else is Kroger helping people stay, stay safe in its stores? So we also have social social distancing signs and decals that are marked um, throughout the store to kind of let customers know where to stand. We added um, some additional signage at our bake aisle and some of our high traffic aisles just because of the additional traffic during the holidays. We also have um, announcements out in the parking lot as well as in our stores. And then uh, we recently have been really working on um, that 50% occupancy. So in some cases this past week, we had to meter and, and actually um, have customers wait until we were at a certain level of customers in our stores. That is fantastic. And Kroger is also all about helping people give back to the community. And I understand there are several ways that Kroger makes it easy for customers to give back. Can you tell us about that? Yep, absolutely. So uh, we are doing a food drive right now with the University of Kentucky and Louisville with red bags and the proceeds uh, for all those donations go to Dare to Care or a local food bank in the area. We also have our Salvation Army angel trees that went up last Sunday. So for folks that want to grab an angel and, and give back to the community, and then we also have our coin boxes at the registers for folks that just want to put in a little bit of spare change uh, for zero hunger, zero waste. I have to say it's so heartwarming that even though people are having tough times, that people still want to give back. It really is amazing. Yeah, yeah it's been an incredible year. Uh, folks are so generous, so you're exactly right. And, and, okay, we all know that the holidays can be hectic enough without having to worry about cooking holiday meals. I, myself, am not a very good cook, but Kroger's here to help make all of our, all of our lives a little easier. Is that right? Yeah, absolutely. So we have all kinds of options for our customers. Um, for folks that want to be um, the chef, right, you can always check in with our, our butchers, and they can give you some great recommendations on uh, meats. And, and our deli bakeries obviously have all kinds of options, whether they're sides or fully cooked dinners. And then we have a full range of party platters for uh, customers to choose from. And, and for those that um, just want to have um, groceries delivered, we are partnering with Instacart. And for contactless shopping, we also offer pickups. So a wide variety of options for our customers during the holidays. That is amazing. And if people want to do their shopping online, where can they go to do that? Yep. So absolutely. You can go to Kroger.com and it'll give you all kinds of options. So you can do pickup, Instacart delivery, or ship to home, uh, which some customers want to use for some of their products. Yeah, which is amazing. And I have to say to you that through all of this time that Kroger is the only place that I have felt safe going. So I personally want to thank you and everyone at Kroger for like making such a clean, safe environment. Thank you. We appreciate that so much. Uh, it has uh, been a team effort, and we're really proud to serve uh, the Louisville community. Okay. Thank you so much, Anne, for talking with me today. I really appreciate it. Happy holidays. You too.